Moyara, this was your number two speech. And the number two speech from our basic manual is about organizing our speech. You're supposed to have a beginning that catches the audience, a body, typically with three points in the, the body of the speech, and then a conclusion that sums up the talk. <coughs> I think you did a very good job of following the manual instructions. All of those elements were present. I love the title. Just even before you spoke, the title caught my interest. It was a great title. And I have the feeling that it's a burgeoning problem in this world. We're all interested in this subject. It's something that's in the news a lot right now in terms of the Swiss bank accounts and where is all this money for financing in the Afghanistan war going. So I thought it was very appropriate. I loved your use of props. Certainly taking the dirty water, I'm not sure. I guess that was tea. I hope that was tea. <laughs> and putting it into oh. uh, oh. no, just a little Coke on the side. <laughs> <laughs> and mixing it with water, I feel much better. Because <laughs> <laughs> when I think of wandering, I think of other kinds of water and wastewater. And my mind goes other places. And I love the carrying case, James Platt example, as well, to make your point. I also like the way you laid out the three points of placement, layering, and integration, and you got to all three of those. Now, what could have been better? I think you could have stated the magnitude of the problem. In a way, this is more like a conversation you might have at a cocktail party. Instead of, money laundering is a terrible thing. It finances these awful people who are doing these terrible things. And this is, without money laundering, they wouldn't be able to buy arms and kill people and blow up buildings and all that sort of thing or something equivalent. And I just think that was missing from your beginning. It would have been more powerful. If you pause a little more between your points, I think we can assimilate what you just said. And this is something we all learn to do as we speak. We tend to speak too fast when we're nervous and in the beginning of our speaking career. So you could work on that some more. And then just one little playful thing you may not know you do, but you play with your hair quite a bit. And at the end, you actually had your hand up here, doing something with your hair. Now, when you see the blog, you'll say, did I really do this? <laughs> so that's a very nitpicky thing, but we're here to learn, so I tell you that. I love your presence. I love how articulate you are. You are a very capable presenter of your material. And I look forward to number three, which is get to your point.